What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Devlin, and uh, I'm gonna do a little let's play for you right now. Super Mario World. We're taking it, taking it back. We're going old school because I'm an old man. Well, compared to most people on YouTube, anyway. Um, I just beat this game recently because I thought it'd be fun. But I'm gonna start a new game right now for you guys, and I'm gonna skip all this crap. You can pause it and read it, I guess, if you want. That's not letting me skip it. Oh my god. I'm gonna apologize in advance because my room <clears throat> is sweltering hot. Like, it's really hot. So I have to keep my windows open, and my house is, like, right on something of a highway. So there's cars zipping by, and they're, like, really loud sometimes. So if you can hear that, I apologize in advance. Holy... Oh, that was a rough start. That was a... Uh... That was a rough start. That's funny because when I was playing this before, like two days ago, I got like past the first five areas without dying, and I just died right there. So I guess the uh, the pressure I can't handle the pressure. It's getting to me. You guys just make me nervous. I just want to impress everybody. That's all. Oh my god. Okay. I'm contemplating starting over, but where would where would the fun be in that? You guys need to see all my mistakes and blunders. That's what makes that's what makes a good live let's play series is all the f ups. I haven't made a video in a long time. I'm like, should I swear? Should I not swear? This is very strange. I'm usually super comfortable, but now I'm like, I'm rusty. It's been a while. So, as I mentioned in uh, the video I put up, kind of talking about what's going on in my life, which I actually haven't recorded yet. It's going to be sort of like a. Uh, Sort of like a Quentin Tarantino thing. I'm starting like in the future and I'm gonna record that video. But it's gonna be put up before this video. It's gonna be a whole it's gonna be a whole thing. But um, in that video I kinda talk about um, what's going on in my life and why I haven't uh, been making videos and the fact that I'm like super unreliable when it comes to videos. Um, I was pretty good for keeping uh, a schedule when I first started YouTube. And then I just kind of got busy. I made, you know, I made that video like eight months ago talking about um, my new uh, life and what's going on and how I'm starting school. And I started that Silent Hill Let's Play and I was going to do the Portal 2 Let's Play as well. And then things kind of got messed up. Uh, first of all, the program I was using to record videos, um, it recorded in really good quality, but the file sizes were huge. Like a five minute video would be, you know, like three gigs and that would be on medium quality. So I didn't really know what to do and how to fix that so that was like one problem and then I had of course school which uh, ended up getting pretty busy um, and I kind of dedicated myself to that but that kind of worked out pretty well in my first semester I got a, like a 92 average so that was pretty cool so I kind of dropped the ball there and then my laptop broke and I procrastinate a lot and I still haven't got it fixed I'm actually recording this on my old desktop computer and the only reason that's possible is because um, I'm doing uh, Super Nintendo games right now. So it can actually handle that. Even, although even in these games, the um, right now, right now, kind of if there's a lot going on on the screen, it slows down and lags quite a bit. So um, hopefully that doesn't get too bad at any point. So yeah, that's just kind of, that's, that's what's been going on. Um, but like I said, it's all been explained in the video that I posted prior to this. I didn't want to pluck that show. Um, again, which is weird saying that because I've already, or I haven't recorded that yet. What up, Yoshi? What up, Holmes? Um, I didn't, gosh. Um, so yeah, you guys are sort of up to date with what's going on. I can't promise a super regular schedule, but I can definitely tell you that if I've got time, um, I, I definitely got the itch to make videos again now and then. Probably won't be nearly as in-depth as I was before. Like I said, I was pretty consistent. I had like my Wednesday, Saturday schedule and such. But now, like, I just want to do it for fun, so I kind of miss doing it. So hopefully you guys are into that. I know a lot of people have unsubscribed. They're probably like, wow, this guy is just ridiculous. He's always like, I'm back, and then he's not back. And if you guys had a nickel for every time I said that I'm back and I'm ready to rock and roll, and then there'd be a big break after that, you would have like, I don't know, 20, 25 cents, maybe. 
don't know, would, you'd be well on your way to a McDouble or McDonald's, which are like a dollar forty something. Fantastic value. The only difference between a McDouble and a Big Mac is the bun that goes in the middle. You can even get a McDouble, and in most places, they won't even charge you extra to put Mac sauce on it. The same sauce they have uh, the Big Macs on the Big Macs. So it's it's fundamentally the same burger without the middle bun for oh, like no money, no money. And I don't know why I'm talking about McDonald's right now. I feel like that says something about me. Something that's not good. Although before I jump off the McDonald's topic, the McDouble I used to praise like crazy. I tell everyone get McDoubles because they're awesome value. But I've uh, discovered something even better, new. Um, also on the value menu with the McDouble is the Junior Chicken. And there's something I read about on a website called Cracked that does comedy articles um, called the McGangbang. You heard right, the McGangbang. And it's when you buy a McDouble and a Junior Chicken, and then you stick the Junior Chicken right inside the McDouble. Like you just split it right between the two patties and throw the Junior Chicken, like bun and all, you just throw it right in there. And it's like $3, it's under $3, and it's so good. I mean, not for you, obviously, but it's pretty tasty. So yeah, if you guys have a, a McDonald's nearby. If you've got guts, you can actually go in and order a McDouble, or I should say a McGangbang, and see if they'll make it for you. Some places, if the employees are uh, familiar with it, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, I thought it was gonna fall. Uh, if the employees are familiar with it, they'll actually make the burger for you um, in the back and just charge you for a McDouble and a, and a junior chicken. But um, some places will you know, obviously look at you like you're fucking out of your mind and give you like looks like you're a sociopath and you're probably gonna wait for them in the parking lot after work so you kind of got to roll the dice with that but let me tell you if you can work up the courage to order a mcgangbang and it and it works out it'd probably be like the best thing ever i personally i'm too much of a chicken shit to try it but i encourage everyone else to to go for it and see what happens if you do try it because of me oh i don't want that mushroom um leave a comment in any one of my videos and just be like I asked for McGangbang, and here's what happened. Because I would love to know. I think it would be hilarious. Um, so yeah, I haven't really talked about Mario very much. Oh no. Oh crap, I'm going to have to swim. Oh, see? See? It's lagging. It's lagging. Um, this is one of my favorite Mario games ever made. For the old Super Nintendo. Um, I did a childhood gaming video a while back. Talking about... Uh, my grandma Shirley, who wasn't actually my blood grandmother, but was pretty much filled in for our grandmother at times. And uh, she used to like play video games with me, and this is the game she would watch me play. And I don't know, maybe it's just like ingrained in me as the best game of all time. But I, I love it, I love it. I can go back and play... Crap, I don't want flowers. I can go back and play this game anytime. I'm screwing this up big time. Jeepers. Try to get a mushroom on this one or something. Oh, what the heck? A whole two lives. 